there's no way. Look at you pretending like you know what the fuck you're doing. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> you can ride with this then ride with New World Order 2035, which is a mega game of about 100 people. We were Mexico, peace was our mission, and it was confusing as fuck. Now you can experience that awesome confusion through this vlog. Check in that, yeah, yeah, open that. What's in there? All our shit. This is like, it's like all our shit. It's like all our stuff, man. I don't know what any of this is. Stickers, I don't know what this is. Allied 2. Hypersonic missiles? That's way too many hypersonic missiles for Andy to be in charge of. What? You get, you're in charge of all these hypersonic <laughs> missiles. Oh my god, I hope I don't have to use these. Used to make a pull Ooh, action. that 10 influence card's big, I think. Action cards? Or maybe it's this. Give us the fucking money? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Look at the picture. <laughs> Who is that? An overblown and self a rock star. Watch the public ad campaign. I think you should either. I don't know what a WFP is. <laughs> I don't know what a UNHRCR is. I don't know. That's my job. Oh, great. So you're, uh, are you, are you ministering defense right now or what? Yeah. I feel like I should be the people that goes to make friends. I feel like this should be defense minister with these bad boys right here. What's going on with that? I tried. It cost a million bucks for any of these for to, for to use them to attack. For me to use them? Yeah. So if you're One like, mega buck. Do you know what you're doing? I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, I don't want to come fish it. You can have it. Oh. Gosh. My plan is to play defense. <laughs> Ours too, actually. Don't piss anyone off. That's exactly what we said. Let's not <laughs> piss anyone off. Hands up all the people who are here. <laughs> hey. Okay, hands up all those that are not here. With some. Are there any scientists in the room? Oh look, here is a group of internationally renowned geniuses, polymaths, and all-round giant intellects. These are the people that you go to to do science. And they are really, really clever at it. During the course of the game, there will be elections to the Security Council and I'm guessing some of you might, there might be some friendly rivalry about who gets elected. Supporting the world's economy, of course, we can't really go on without mentioning the importance that the corporate world brings to the new world order. We have four major companies. No, you go alone. But you need to see it. Yeah, yeah, go with him, go with him. that I can go. Yeah, you can right now, exactly. Yeah, go. Asking yeah, here, bring bring this. Oh, I don't want it. Just capture it. No, I don't want it. Just face it towards oh, me. Cool? Yeah, whatever. All right, yeah. <laughs> Wait, what's that? Don't look at that. <laughs> I'm just very confused. Everybody will be for two hours. Yeah. Okay. And then this is going to be uh, in play for you guys for the rest of the game. Cool. What is that? This is going to, if a global warming treaty happens, everybody's uh, PR, which affects your economy, is going to tank. It's going to go down to three. It's really, really low. But if you have this technology in play, you get to increase that by one. And there's a whole bunch of techs like this, FYI, which can help you really mitigate the impact of a global warming treaty. So you can be sounding like you want the global warming because you're good, but it's actually because you know you're going to be richer than everybody else with global warming. So wait, $1 million this turn. If you loan us $1 million, we will give you $2 million next turn. Why? Sounds like a good deal. They're right next to us. We're trying to fund our research centers and we're short $1 million. Really short $1 million? Yeah. And we, I have a contract signed up. We'll take a loan of $1 million. No, okay, yeah. No is that is that signed? Japan. I've signed this. If you give us... That, uh, Matt, you want to check this out and sign that, and then we'll give one million? This looks official. We're taking one million, and we're going to give you two million next time. I like it. Matt. It's the, Mexico. No, it's the Prime Minister. He made the call, and we already signed the deal. <laughs> Got to be faster there. Dude, you just made a great deal. Yeah. So, <laughs> I also funded a family in Uzbekistan. The Pope came to see me. Yeah. Uzbekistan? Oh, wait. What about the famine? Did you know? Coke Costini? Hold on, guys. Family in Uzbekistan that needs sponsoring. What I got. They said, uh, um, Turkmenistan, there's a famine. You heard yeah. about that? I think that maybe that's what he said. Turkmenistan. Oh. Uzbekistan. I don't know what he said. Well, yeah, U Uzbekistan was part of it, but like Turkmenistan, there's a famine. And, uh, so I gave a million dollars, and then Canada gave two, but then we got the money back because we have one free launching of it. Wait, what? You went fucking crazy. <laughs> that room was nuts. What the hell you're saying? People banged the table at one point. No, no. Yeah, someone banged the table for attention. Can I know 
know what you just said though? Okay, there's a famine in Turkmenistan. Uh, how do you know? Because it was on Twitter. Okay, what, you guys just watched the Twitter feed in your meeting? No, it's on the wall there, look. No, it was on there. Look, see, it's right there. Okay. Look at it. It's up, up to date stuff. Things change. Yeah, I know. I really need to know to what the them. fuck Brazil is. We value information. Yeah. Okay. So you you would okay, trade population just for information? No. You want population? We want population. That's what you require? Yeah. What here represents population? The population card. Just this one card? Yeah. No, we're not giving that. Where is our population? That's your population card right there. No, but where is uh, how much population do we have? I assume you have just one. You may get an extra one every turn. It's in your rules. Uh, I'll, I'll just come back. Let's hold off on this until we have more. Okay, you got us allied with USA in technology? No, in economy. Economy. U.S. grants rare earth extraction rights in USA. Oh my God, that's so good. And I'm trying to get us at the top in That's going to be really important to us for yeah. with anyone. But I'm trying to get us to the top in popularity. I'm almost there. And there's no one trying to compete with me. Okay, that's good because there's also a rare earth metal shortage. I'm a disease. We have to talk to the president. Where is he? No, I'm the new president now. Are you? Well, yeah, we kind of changed roles. He's going to the map from now on. Okay, and where I'm is he? They're also being replaced by General Aerospace, who signed a deal with who's moving to Nigeria. They're, they're relocating their company to Nigeria. Okay, General Aerospace. Okay, uh, your stock value is down by five. Because this looks really, really dubious and it's shaking corporate confidence. So, can you make sure right now that you go reduce your stock value by five? We got our technology? Not yet. Why are you clapping? They made it. We made it. We made progress in that regard. So, don't we get it right away when it's made? Yeah. Look at him. You ask him right there. You ask him right there. Right? So, uh, science control. You ask him. Do it right now. Yeah, he'll give it to us right now. Okay, the U.S. is immediately going on military alert. A Turkish aircraft carrying a nuclear weapon has crashed into New York. A Turkish weapon carrying a nuclear weapon. Someone, you need a rep here. Turkey, right now, right now. Turkey, okay. Are you mobilizing your forces as the U.S. moves against What did they do? They, they, <laughs> they crashed a nuclear weapon into New York City. Who cares how? Why? Why? <laughs> Accidentally. You really screwed us this time, Daryl. There is an emergency crisis meeting in the U. As the U.S. Wait, hang on. requires that the oh. Security Council. The United Nations Security Council is out of communication. Oh. We've lost all contact with New York. Turkish military have destroyed UN, UN headquarters. Okay, could we have all UN staff lying in the middle of the floor? <laughs> I want them right now, Secretary General. Find the UN staff and lay them out. Who has medical training here? Seriously, if you have first aid certification, not if you're because you're a casualty, get over there. Get, get over. There. Okay, you were in the field. Okay, thank God. You don't know what Turkey does. I don't know what you get. Okay. The defense minister of Turkey has been found dead, as well as the um, the prime minister of Turkey. There's a septic assassination on his life. He has since defended himself, is now in recovery, and will do fine for the next little bit. We shall see. And um, and the, the and pointers, fingers have been pointed towards. Um, 
Saudi Arabia, <laughs> alas. Uh, and you heard it here first, folks. Uh, General management. Sorry? General management was found to have sold the new. General Aerospace? General Aerospace was found to have sold the new. Which landed in New York. I want to see evidence. <laughs> Don't make those noise. Oh, yeah. 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 Show your evidence. Oh, Matt might say. Probably America is really up. Which one? This one, eh? No. We've got automatic, yeah. And what's the other one? So take this. That one? You get to choose from three, don't you? Uh, yeah, the other one was the same one I already have. Take that. That one? This is important, I'm going to take this. Okay. What's unclear energy? Oh, energy. Yeah. They're, they're typoing the Twitter. Yeah. We've brought dinosaurs back. We've decided that we will draw the line at Terminator. <laughs> the scientific community unilaterally condemns the invention of sentient AI by Japan and calls all countries to oppose this move that they have made. Um, as the inventor of AI, <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Japan would like to make a statement. <laughs> what we have created, the, the machine we have created, Micro, that has ended all military communications around the world. This is a crisis. Oh. This is world peace. <laughs> Croft's assistance, a vessel capable of faster than light travel, which will carry aboard it the consciousnesses of any volunteers who wish to go aboard. You've ended sovereignty. <laughs> you can keep your land. If you want to stay, you're welcome to. Back to Japan. Look, the climate. Look, guys. The climate is collapsing. Would your AI create a sex pod? Question: Answers. Would your AI create another sex pod? No. No. <laughs> Can it be used as one? <laughs> and we feel threatened. Who's threatened? We're Please. offering it to you. Can we want you to come Mexico. with us. Yes. Mexico supports robots, also. Which is why we don't talk about winners and losers. <laughs> Why is Mexico this paradise of high PR all the time? The Mexicans kept coming to me either with text or just buying PR every single turn. And so Mexico, everyone is happy. Everyone is there are riots in the streets about Mycroft. Some of you are down to two or three. And in Mexico, it may be marijuana, of course. <laughs> uh, not everyone can do all the things they want to. Many of you have encountered un unforeseen outcomes. Andy. Find the principle of this, and play with it.